Use differentials to estimate the amount of the metal in a closed cylindrical can that is 13 cm high, 6 cm in diameter. If the metal in the top and the bottom is 0.09 cm thick, and the metal is in the sides is 0.01 cm thick, rounded to the nearest hundreds. Okay, basically, remember the formula for the volume first. The volume will be pi r square h. So that is the volume of the closed cylindrical can. Like so. That is because we're taking uh, the circumference, pi r squared, and multiplying by the height, which is h, like so, r. Now, let's use differentials to approximate the answer. d v is going to be, 2 goes down, pi r, h, and then dr, that is derivative with respect to r, plus with respect to h is going to be pi r square h dh. So different derivatives, partial derivatives, right? But these are given, so dr and dh. dr is 0 0.01 approximately, dh is 0 0.18. That is because we need to take into account the diameter of the top and the bottom. Each is 0 0.09. So I can, I guess, just tell you 0 0.09 plus 0 0.09, 0 0.18. That is diameter metal. In the, if the metal in the top and the bottom is this amount thick mm -hmm. and size is 0 0.01 so that's the approximation over there now other things are given h is 13 right radius is given as 6 but not 6 6 is diameter so 6 over 2 which is 3 let's plug everything we know dv can be approximated as 2 pi, r was given as 3, h was given as 13, well r is 6 over 2, dr is 0 0.01 plus pi, r squared is given as 3, so squared, and then H isn't supposed to be here in the formula, that's a mistake, because we're differentiating with respect to H, so that gives you 1. But DH is 0 0.18. If you simplify everything, it gives you 7.54 centimeters cube. And that is the answer, and that is the approximation of the volume. So that's how we used differentials to approximate volume of the with, of the can with a given shape and some kind of approximations of the thickness of the top and the bottom and sides.